Okay, in this video, I'm gonna talk about uh, something that's really uh, important to point out. Uh, I've been living here in the United States uh, for a while, and uh, I see the problem that a lot of uh, uh, African Americans are making is, I mean, the mistakes that they're making is, they, they want to get integrated into the, uh, they, uh, they have some sort of uh, claims, okay, from, from the mainstream society, which is mainly composed by, by white. So they want to have integration, they want to have jobs. So they have a lot of, uh, what do you call it, grievances. This is the wrong way to go. The, you know, they want to integrate. They want to marry a white woman. They want it to be uh, in the white neighborhood. This is the wrong way to go about the whole thing. I mean, that shows that you don't love your own community. You don't love your own people, okay? But you want to be part of uh, a different world. You are You are operating in a world where your your race is not a predominant. Your race is 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 a minority somehow. So the predominant race was able to establish themselves, and uh, now you wanted to be part of their their world. That's a mistake. Okay, that's a huge mistake. What you need to focus on how to build your own community, how to uh, make sure that your community is, is safe, your community is healthy, okay? This is the most important part. You know, I never understood the idea that uh, you wanted to be part of this race, their community, and they will reject you. I never understood that. I don't want to be part of this community. I already have my own community. I'm very proud of where I am, where, where I'm from. Why I need to be part of the world where you will be judged, you will be, uh, of course, you will be discriminated against because this is not your world. You, this is, you're entering into a, a territory where it's a different territory, okay? In terms of your race, in terms of your culture. The best thing to do is to focus on yourself. Marry your, your woman, you know, build your business in your community, okay? Try to excel in your community, try to build your community so that you can get respect to, uh, from other communities. This idea that you have to, to absolutely push the, uh, the diversity agenda, okay, where and then the problem with that is people do not respect your community, your race. Okay? In order for you to, to be respected, you have to, to be proud of where you are from. And making proud meaning you have to work on it so that uh, your community is better. Okay? It has a a lot of things that the other communities have, okay? Then you will be proud of your own community. Instead of when you are, when you, when you, when you get rich, you, you move out of your community and you go to a different community, completely different one, okay? And then, of course, you will be looked at uh, different. Of course, you will experience some racism because you are operating in a world where you, your, your people are not there, okay? You, ha you have a physical differences that's very uh, obvious and people will judge you based on that. Yeah. So the, the best way to, to go about this whole integration thing, you know, diversity and all of this nonsense, you have to be proud of 
your own community. You have to build it from the ground up. If, you, if there are problems, you, you, t you know, you gotta have, you gotta have, you have to come up with the uh, solutions in order to build your own community and uh, maintain a healthy community. Otherwise, you're losing on both sides. When you go to the other world, you're, you're not accepted, okay? Because you are entering into a different world where you are not welcome. And, uh, and then in your community, you don't build it. it you know, there's a destruction. So you have, to, you have to be proud of where you're from. You have to instill in your children, you know, your history, where you guys came from, so that they understand. They are proud of where they are from. I'm from a community where, I'm, I'm originally from Chad, where we, we have our own history. We, we, have, we occupy the biggest land in my country, okay? Because my people were the fighters. They always fight for their rights, okay? And we have our own culture, and we do not really envy other people's culture. We don't really care about them, okay? So we, we love ourselves and then people respect us. But in this case, it applies here too. You, you gotta love yourself first, then you'll be able, to, then people will be able to respect you. Instead of trying to, uh, oh, trying to marry a white woman and uh, Oh, their parents are judging me. Of course they will judge you. What, what do you think? Because they are a completely different race. Okay. So, to make it easier, let's, let's build the community. Let's uh, really make the community healthy so that it becomes livable. So that people can respect you. But instead of uh, trying to really force yourself into a, a white structure, a white world, it's a completely, it's completely a waste of time because you are trying to force yourself into a world where you are not really accepted, you know? So why not, you might just as well build your own world so that other people would be envy will respect you. So these are my few thoughts. If you have something that you want to add it, go ahead and do it.